possibly be used against him. But also it's attracting Argonauts and other... Uh, other enemies of Ariston. And so now you are all dwelling up in this skies. And this massive, gigantic ship uh, called the Last Word. It is owned... Uh, by Barbara, but this ship was uh, a reward for all of you um, through your years of service. It is an incredibly efficient airship, uh, and these things down there are supposed to be like fighters, like fighter airships, but uh, they're not there right now. Um, you are far above the clouds, far above anything that could alert you, and if anything, ca if anything in the region is alerted of your presence. It's not like they can stop you right now. Barbara makes her way over. Doo, doo, doo. Darius, why don't you describe to me what you are doing and uh, what your room looks like? Uh, I would say my bedroom, my master bedroom, would look like uh, it's all tainted in gold. Uh, the floor would be like this dark, uh, like this dark oak. Very pristine, very like, uh, how do you call it? Uh, it's sh very shiny to the point where you can see a reflection. And uh, the the paint the there will be multiple paintings, just very uh, very pristine and very uh, rich in decoration, so to speak. And the walls of themselves would be like a wine red. Okay. As for the bed, it's as for the bed, it's just a master a big master bed. As you were sleeping, you're resting. Uh, your weapon, the Wild Star, probably not too far. Uh, Barbara, right next to me in the bed. Yeah, <laughs> like it. it is. Uh, it is your uh, most faithful tool. Uh, you hear a doo -doo. Barbara. It like it sounds like a thought in the bed too. <laughs> it's got its own pillow. Uh, and as, Bar and as uh, Barbara approaches, uh, just instinctively I pull out the gun. You pull out the gun, and, sh and sh before the door opens, before the re release valve releases the pressure she goes Dari don't worry it's just me mind if I come in ah oh, Barbara but of course you can come in and then the release valve tss, she's 6'1 uh, she... that's tall for me <laughs> yeah. uh, it's tall, tall for human size uh, uh, but um, par par pardon my pardon my Ah, oh, don't worry about it. I I got used to uh, your eccentricities, but wanted to tell you that uh, we're gathering up the crew. I don't mind the others. Meet, meet, meet me up on the main deck. Anything you uh you want want to ask me before I leave and grab the others? Uh, no, nothing much, love. And she'll give you a wink. Uh, and she'll say, "All right, I'll meet you on the top deck." Would you anything? And she will uh, overly, enthousi overly enthusiastically blow a kiss, and she will make her way to the next individual. We're going through all the Europeans first. Oh, oh, gee, god damn. <laughs> so, wow. Mr. Raza Burns, uh, what, what, describe to me what your room looks like, and then describe to me what you were doing before Barbara <clears throat> makes her way over. The room is covered in tapestries, in... Uh, reveling in the flames of the phoenix uh, as well as there's a fireplace a pretty massive one that is shining brightly with uh, iridescent flames <clears throat> uh, as Ross himself will be in front of the fireplace um, make uh, whispering prayers to himself how do you Barbara Raza my boy how you doing I'm doing well enough. Have you completed your daily prayer? Uh, more or less. I think uh, I think it counted right. Good. Good. What is your business? Besides being graciously taking the time to look upon your visage, I uh, wanted to call you up to the top deck. We're about to assemble the team. Uh, anything you wanted to let me know before I ran off to the others? Oh. 
No, nothing special. Well, won't you have a drink with me after this mission, then? I'll gladly. And she will... I will say, what sort of, what sort of drink... Uh, I would say Raza and Barbara probably had drinks with each other before. Okay, what, what is it? What is a what is a drink in particular that you you two would have shared? What do you think? A fireball. <laughs> <laughs> the Phoenix fireball, dude. That's classic. Dude, classic, classic. I'm gonna roll a perception check to see if uh, Oscar would hear the drink part. Go ahead. What? Roll per- perception. The first roll. I'm gonna say yeah. You, you probably would have heard. It. You probably would have heard it. Legendary perception. Yeah. <laughs> Rogue moment. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, Oscar said we just pop in from the door and say, "Oh, I can't meet till yeah." Barbara turns around. She goes, "Oh, yeah. Why not? More the merrier, right?" Of course. How many fights. Uh, you. I will be assigning you as a commander. Uh, Darius will be your captain. Everything should be okay. But uh, anything you want to uh, let me know before I run off and grab Shimtek? I'll raise one eyebrow as I'm speaking to you. What do we know about this mission? Anything in particular? Besides the fact that you're trying to unearth some betrayal from one of Ariston's vassals. Something about an old machine. So, uh, that is to say, you might find some, uh, might find some constructs you might get to throw your hands with, you know? But I also heard that there were some cyclopes in the area as well. So, you know, if you ever wanted to punch a one-eyed giant. It is... A cyclops is an interesting battle, but it becomes less interesting if you focus the eye. But that it assumes you have adequate aim. And I'll, I'll open my eyes and stand up. And we save the best for last, ain't that right, person? <laughs> <laughs> Look at that knee. <laughs> no. oh. <laughs> He's a serious character. Dude. I asked I asked Percy, like, Percy, should I make a different token for me? He was like, nah, this is good. This is good. This is good. We, we need we need some of the light and the darkness to balance it out. <laughs> I wait, have the light. wait, wait, roll a 1d1 to see who you want to go to next. Oh you're right, you're right, you're right. Uh let's go, let's go uh 1d1. Uh, 1D1. Holy How shit. did he do it? I, how did I do it, dude? Powerful. Um and everyone on the ship knows this. I want to. I want to double. I want to let you all know. Like, there's like over a hundred like regular airship workers here, and they all give you guys a wide berth. Yeah, just, they all give you guys a wide berth, and they all give you guys like respect. Like all of them. Are, every, every time you pass by, every, everyone's bowing in your direction. So that that is the that is the level of command and respect you guys uh, are given. Uh, Barbara knocks on the door. Distinctive knock. I hear the release spouts <clears throat> open, and uh, she peeks her head through, and uh, she says, "Looking out again." I can never stop the grind, Barbara. <laughs> she she nods. That's the fucking voice. <laughs> I can't I can't go I can't go as deep as I as I did the other day. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong, dude? It's the Shimtek Mindek voice, dude. And now that uh, assembling the old crew, meet them, but meet them up uh, on the main deck. About to launch you guys out to your main mission now, and I'll, I'll spill out more of the details. But uh, needless to say, how are you feeling? I'm feeling very fired up. Good, Having good. A, we'll, we'll need some of that while, fire going in. Been a been a while since we've been a uh, went on a mission with the old friends like this. And she will she will smile and she will say. It's always good to get the band back together, especially in such a such a region such as uh, Western Welland here. The moment you guys set foot on the land, no doubt you'll cause people to shit their pants knowing that uh, the ultimate militia are lying about. But uh, anything you want to let me know before I head off back to the main deck? No, not really. Thank you for uh, thank you for letting me know. Of course, Shimmy, and uh, she will make her way out. Uh, yeah, you guys would know each other's, like, nickname, or even, at least, give each other nicknames that you would all tolerate, Look, um. Only the real ones can call me Shimmy. Yeah. Are, 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 are any of these guys you feel If you feel like that. No, 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 yeah. they have to feel like that. If they feel like that, they can do it. Oh, no, I thought that I could roll for it. I mean, yeah, you can roll for it if you want. <laughs> what would this be? What would this <clears> roll be? Is Ross a, is Ross a real one? No. 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 
Rosa. No, you are level. fake as hell. You honestly true to his character. I'll call I'll call you Shimmy regardless. Oh my god. Dude. Oh it's guru. Real as hell. <laughs> the realest motherfucker around. <laughs> he's not even from the material. <laughs> How did this bond for <laughs> Very you're all level. my oomphies, and then you whisper to Oscu, but you're my real oomph. <laughs> but uh, you know, is there anything, any conversation you guys uh, want to have with each other before I'm Barbara a, shows up? I'm guessing I'm the last one to walk into the war room, right? Because mm -hmm. she was the last one to get me. I'll walk in and go like, "It's nice to see all you glorious bastards again. <laughs> I'm looking forward to uh, looking forward to uh, another mission with you all." And he's going to uh that down on the two, two bar stools that were laid out for him. <laughs> Planting one cheek at a time. <laughs> yeah. Is there oranges at the table? Yes. But it's cool. he's supposed to be evil. He likes apples. <laughs> <laughs> it runs in the family! <laughs> Damn. <laughs> How did it get to Harry? It oh, runs no. in the family. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh, the long lore. <laughs> the, the long... Pains are... Well, how are they going? <laughs> Brilliant. They're all, right. they're all, they're all sitting up. Everyone, everyone is rioting. Everyone is starting to rebel against the systems of of uh, current war and politicians. Eventually, uh, I'll take over. Limited. And. There wouldn't happen to be any believers of the Phoenix among those rebels. I'd be happy to accept them. Among the rebels? Hmm. You could always visit and see them for yourself. Better yet, you could, you, could, you could help with this revolution. Oh. Unfortunately, diluting my political campaigns, my very own. That's, uh, not my business, but I'm thankful for the offer. Uh, which, what kind of woman are you into, even? I'll admit I haven't been paying attention, but I, when when I hear that question, I'm going to stare at Shimtech because now I'm genuinely curious. <laughs> <laughs> he cocks one eyebrow open. <laughs> well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a take a long, a long wolf sip. Of my oh. words, you set it back down and go. I'm a fan of any woman. I have no qualms with anyone. Uh, so it's well, so long as it's not the uh, an elf. <laughs> <laughs> now, Darius, I don't share your. I don't. I don't share a lot of your political beliefs, but I agree with you on that, brother. <laughs> <laughs> And that's when the that's when the MAGA hat appears on both your heads. <laughs> uh, this is me old mate uh, Cyrus. Uh, he asked me to do some spying stuff, and uh, you won't believe what I found. Oh, what'd you find? See, uh, there was a uh, fella by I don't remember the name, but uh, I believe he was like at the age of fifty or sixty, human-looking fella. Turns it out it's not such really important. Uh, I was supposed to, you know, um, but, uh, I, well, I just, uh, let's say, got carried away and uh, discovered his um, personal office. There was a lot of um, decent trinkets and stuff, but, uh, and uh, I also found uh, this. Uh, he pulls out, like, a sheet of paper. Mm hmm. <clears throat> Are you, are, you, are you handing it to him? Yeah. Okay, I'll go ahead and I'll grab the paper. I'll start reading. Uh, I, I'm guessing the rats like get get an audible fucking sigh and then they just uh start walking normally. Yeah, they just start not walking normally yeah. away. And then, I, and then I say, oh, they they freeze up. But uh, bring three more beers. The fi the finest you could find of my of my of my uh, preference. Yes, of course, Master Spiroff, and uh, they'll they'll both uh, they'll both bow and then they'll make their way out. <clears throat> Apologies uh, for my for my foolishness. I only order for shit, shit me, but for everyone. Not to worry, I um, prefer not to drink. <clears throat> no, 
It um, it inhibits my ability to attain the phoenix's immortality. That's the great. That's the great thing about beer. You drink it quickly, it goes quickly. They kind of both look to each other, and they kind of look to you, man. Darius. You hurt the man. One of them will nod, and uh, will grab will grab the plate and the uh, the mug of beer. The other one, he'll get hand the uh, plate to the other one, and they'll slowly make their way out. I say, I say, cheers for this reunion. But you know, you know how uh, you know that Warven saying of cheers in my language. Back at the em- back at the emerald and uh, diamond mines, I used to uh, used to work at. Now I now I own. <laughs> We call rock and stone. <laughs> <laughs> You're <a> fucking bitch. <laughs> well, well, mate, here's one for Carl. And we and we drink and we drink it as quickly as possible. Ariston will, after he's, of course, searched through whatever evidence you find to him, uh, make the final assault and possibly kill D- uh, Dougald here. So. Nothing susp- specific, but Dougald's birthday is coming on and over, and that is when Ariston plans to use that opportunity to set up an ambush and let you all come in for one last hurrah for a birthday, birthday man. The first mission involves you lot going over to the Minshia ruins. That is where the machine was unearthed. It's not where it is right now, but asking the uh, excavation workers there politely would uh, possibly give you a hint as to where they delivered it, or at least who might be handling the machine. The main goal, of course, is to find damning evidence of Dougald, but it's also to find this machine. So, uh, any questions? As some Argonauts, do what you gotta do. You might have to... Apparently there's some rumors that there's some clockwork constructs, some big old motherfuckers are over there as well. So, uh... It'll be nice to get the to get your combat skills out there. Constructs are not as exciting to fight. They are they were created to fight, but there is no true passion. It's not as they're defending themselves. They were told to fight. I'm excited to deal with these Argonauts though. Of course. I mean according to uh I'm sure kinda of flip through. And awkwardly, it kind of takes a little bit before she goes, Alright, sorry about this. My, uh, my, you know, I only got the one good eye left, you know? The ship tech knows. <laughs> yeah. Because <laughs> <laughs> <So delayed. laughs> he was drinking his orange juice. I just imagine from the other end of the table, it's just. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was going for. Oh, you know what? It's, uh. I mean, yeah, what, what, what is. What, I would say, like, Barbara's got everyone assembled, the ramps open. Uh, anything, uh, I'll say Barbara will say, uh, she's yelling, she's, she's saying, all right, if there's anything you all ought need to tell me, just be sure to message, I've, I've given each of you a sending stone, so if you're fucked off into the abyss or something, it'll still work, it's expensive stuff, make sure the sending stone's okay. What? <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, I'll message you all later. And she'll say, go, go, what? go. Uh, yeah, yeah, go, um, go, 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 go! <laughs> yeah, well, Rescar will not even like from this drum, uh, the uh, ramp. Uh, he will just face through this. He, just, he will just face through the floor. He just, he just <laughs> <laughs> like no clips down to the floor, uh, which is normal. That is uh, average Oscar behavior from you, from uh, from uh, as long as you guys know him. Uh, ah, what, never change, buddy. <laughs> or otherwise, let me know what else you would rather do uh, instead of doing that. What if I just burn a spell slot you so I fly down? <laughs> you could do that for straight up. Oh, like, yeah. dude. oh yeah, dude. Dude, Shim Tech, dude. Y- y'all know that uh, MP4, like, I'd be, I be in the air with my... Uh, oh, fuck. What, ah, damn. You know the Watcho Jet thing? Watcho Jet. Watcho watch Jet. jet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's doing He's he's doing what that dude was doing. It's like, it's like sky, sky skydiving. Be- and he is going to pull it at the very last second. <laughs> is, he, is he saying the same thing about his balls? <laughs> <laughs> Not well, but he he is. He was like, yeah, uh, I'd be up in the air with my, with my balls and shit. <laughs> I, I, I just imagine Shane Long puts on the the parachute and goes, oh, very well, and then he just walks off. Yeah, he he, crat- he Kratos falls. 
<laughs> That's what Shang Long is doing. So he's just and the songs he's been playing too. Who, Actually, from no. where? Who knows? Uh, he's gonna set up a large ass mansion. And uh, yeah, because you guys aren't just gonna sleep out in the in the in the wilderness. You gotta live like what kings. Fucking <laughs> peasants. Uh, yeah. uh, fellas, uh, fellas, don't you think um, a giant mansion in the middle of the woods is a bit a little bit conspicuous? And no. No. <laughs> Why would it be? What's wrong with you, Oscuro? It's good, Oscuro. Little thing for a little bit of shine and dine. Oscuro, I'm just saying, the moment someone approaches and I just shoot, shoot, uh, shoot a bullet on, uh, in the air. Nah, fair enough, I guess. It kind of echoes in the mountains here. Just just one more for for safety, in case some, someone uh, gets curious and I just shoot, shoot more more. Well, I guess I can also just play the boogeyman. God, I love, I love this gun. Departed from their money. I'm not gonna pretend that I, that I am a nice guy. Far from it. But uh, the, the thing with me is, I recognize, uh, as evil as I am, I recognize, I recognize the, the evil as well in other people. He did not deserve that gun. He didn't deserve the fortunes he had as well. So I just simply uh, took one person, uh, took one for the team. Of course, uh, not he really. considers himself evil. Uh, I mean, he. Because I'm uh, like uh, most uh, villains. I, uh, I, I, I would, I would guess like it's like he, necessary he, evil type beat. Yeah. He, he ah, wants. So. Yeah. His. Yeah. His ends. Uh, he, the ends just to find the means is his. Uh, oh, his dude, order. fuck that! No, I'm good. I'm a good person. We still have some time this morning. Are we in a mood to be sharing? I have something I'd like to share. Oh, by all means, go for it, Shane. Mm. I will pull out my bag and I will dig around for a bit and I will pull out a small black box. Oh no, it's a blank hole. <laughs> I was gonna say this, Pandora's box, but inside this box is something. Are multiple things very powerful, and they they mean a lot to me, of great importance on my journey. Any guesses? Um, how big is the box? That's not too big. Maybe I'd say like as big uh, as a hand. Yeah. Okay, Ooh. I know. I know the size. Mm, it's not the, not the most expensive, but I find it to be valuable. Valuable in terms of, I don't mean it in money, I mean it in spirit. Hmm. It helps raise my spirits, yes. Ah. Oh. Ah, naturally. It has to be tea. Ah, you know me well. And I will open my container of assorted tea bags. <laughs> <laughs> of course. I, I have brought a couple of flavors with me. I have honey apple tea, citrus tea, chamomile, which <laughs> isn't a tea. But... He started reviewing tea. <laughs> really? Uh, this is your. This is your, your. This is your special thing. <laughs> Please. Not as not as not as elaborate as your star weapon, but. It's still nice to have. No, you know? no, I apologize if I sound rude, but it's so funny that you pulled it like that. <laughs> and then here I have some jasmine green tea. I have about five tea bags for each of these flavors, and I brought a bunch of small portions of milk if I need it. <laughs> <laughs> Malik <laughs> waited this entire session just to tea talk. <laughs> I, I, will now, I will now close my box. <laughs> All, all jokes aside, actually, I wanted to show this, and then I will pull out a uh, a small black uh, statue of a horse. Wondrous figurine. <laughs> oh, oh, now I'm interested in the story. I was traveling around as I usually do, and I was held up by a very large man. Asked me for, you know, the usual. How you know how highway men like to operate, but. Despite his large frame and the larger weapon he carried, I was able to defeat him. Now, what I found interesting was he came in riding a horse, 
and it kind of disappeared. Now, I don't personally care too much for a steed, but the man was still alive, so I asked the question. He said he had figurine, which was this thing right here. I took it from him because, honestly, he was, uh, he was not long for this world by that point. So I thought it'd be, it would only be for the best that someone would still care for this steed. I, I don't use it often, but you never know when you need a, what was it he called it, a, a nightmare? I don't know if this will be useful, but it is nice to have. But be careful. If they're too rich, they might disappear overnight. <laughs> Wait, I have to attack this seal from my buddies. So true, Oskuru. Oh, Oskuru. Oh, <laughs> oh, no, I... I dare say I haven't had a chance to... Grab any unique artifacts of my own. I used to have my staff of exoneration, and it has its very straightforward uses. Um, of evocation spells, such as, well, the most destructive kind. I, uh, well, what can I say? I'm traveling light. Farmers of the region, they supply some food, a lot of, a lot of uh, livestock. Uh, they are not known as warriors or anything of the like. Uh, so it's interesting, you, you see that emblem and uh, Darius, with your political knowledge, you obviously know. Uh, why don't you roll me uh, a, a, a politics lore check, if you wanted to learn more about uh, the Difros. <laughs> After all, you are legendary in politics. <laughs> so I specifically picked a nation of lore for this. Go ahead. I'll re -roll. Incredible. Incredible. You gotta use your second re <laughs> oh, <laughs> It's happening. Oh, it's happening, guys. God. Not a not a single roll above ten. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still legendary, so it's still fucking high. Well, the well, live Darius reaction. Someone has camped here recently. I still smell. I, I can smell the embers of a former fire, and I can smell the unique fragrance. 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 Someone here has eaten. I shall go take a look. Okay. Oh! <laughs> you have to understand, playing. this guy's on, he's crawling to his friends, and this is so <laughs> stupid. It's, it's just playing Overload at this point. He's like, HELP! Oh! Oh! About to see some we want to see Shang Long dude. sprint across the map in but one also, action. But also, because I have the speed rune, I have, I am quickened. <laughs> and with, the, with that, I will... <laughs> We're about to see some numbies, fellas. Let's see. Oh, hold on. I, 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 I'm thinking. How do I want to do this? Uh, okay, yeah. Malak already knows he's about to get the. How do you want to do this? He's about to, <laughs> he's about to launch a fucking Tekken combo on this guy. <laughs> oh, you're already five footed, my already... man. <laughs> oh, he's already. The dead. one inch pump. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Roll for attack. This is a zombie, yeah. by the way, so roll for attack. Okay, and I will use. It says I can use an unarmed attack, so I will use the attack from my dragon stunts. Percy, I have to ask. Did you give these guys meaning? Is Unfortunate. <laughs> Hold on, it's okay. That's I haven't not used even a, hero not even yet. A, that's not even a critical miss. Oh! <laughs> oh! Roll for roll for so, damage. It's so sad that like Richard died of like <laughs> leg <my> ball. <laughs> oh! See <LC> jobs. <clears throat> <laughs> you hear, you hear the druid say, "Wait, wait, no, 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 no!" And then immediately, how do you want to do this? They only had twenty-eight health. Damn, I shouldn't have gone overboard, but that's unfortunate. 
<clears throat> uh, Rasa will just... <sighs> we had such good memories, you and I. But you never did join my faith. And then... Uh, reaching out his hand as, to, as, as if to grasp them, but like 30 feet apart. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then you... Boom! <laughs> And as this beam of energy just goes out, it absolutely, 100% disintegrates them and leaves behind their equipment. Just and you hear the elf go, No! Yeah, vengeful hatred is a real thing. Oh <laughs> my nice racism! God. I can't believe fucking Demeter min-maxed racism. <laughs> so go ahead, roll to that's attack. Why it, that's why I asked. It's important to... <laughs> go what ahead. Are you you guys think uh, thought it was just racist? No, I'm optimized racist. That's gonna crit. I'm a min max racist. <laughs> Go ahead, roll damage. And be well, sure to check the box off that says against an elf. Uh, yeah, no yeah. Noticing uh, Darius just point, uh, pointing his gun at the elf. I'm just going to uh, pat him on the shoulder and say, "Sorry, boy, not your day." Wait, <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> How do you want to do this? <laughs> I would like you to know this is this this does this does a little fire damage the entire thing, so it's basically piercing through. It's a fire fucking pierce. Yeah, it's just uh, as you set off the bullet, you feel proud. You know, one less one less elf on this earth. The thing. The first non crit. All right, Demeter. Uh, how do you want to do this? Ooh. Okay, so I pull my gun. Oh, elf. And then I and then I then I like <laughs> I use my like my one singular amber eye to spot the elf from a distance and I'm just like aiming really fucking f not even hesitating just pulling the trigger as fast as possible and the, her brains just like disintegrate her like burning and everything uh her head is basically charged and then I see uh, I see another one pointing ears only means one thing and I reload really quickly shoot again <laughs> and then I do, do the same <laughs> just just to, uh blowing up both of her arms Oh, she's on the precipice. Oh. Let's roll for recovery. Hey, wait, whoa, whoa. Wait, you're, wait, you're wait. attacking? Oh, okay. Uh, I cannot face for the wall, but... Uh, wait. I'm just going to come here in my turn. Nox, Nox okay. think, no, 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 Nox, think about it. Shove her. It'll be fun. Like, so you know what's true? I'm going to shove her. Make an athletics check. <laughs> You guys are just bullying this. <laughs> what the she, fuck? She's just tearing off. She's like, Ransley, no. Okay, guys, I didn't sign up to bully them, that's why I used disintegrate. You <laughs> <laughs> just shoved her! You shoved her on top of her back! No! What the fuck? <laughs> oh, you pushed her into a flanked position. I see, you're a genius. <laughs> Exotic. <laughs> you are the, uh, the fucking devil on Nox's. <laughs> uh, I'm grabbing her. <laughs> Go ahead and make a grapple. That's the uh, athletics, right? Yeah. Hold on, I'm, 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 I'm hyperventilating. Okay. Hold on. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. If you want, like, granted, you could hold get on. the kill, but if you grab her, hold on. I could do a three-action one-inch punch. <laughs> it's not important for the mission, Alec. Mm. I'm going to. We're not bullying them. Uh, I, I, she's well, restrained. Yeah. yeah. But it'll be I'll fun. grab her, I'll pick her up, and I'll go. Do you yield? She she is completely distraught, but she nods. I will drop her. Do you pet her the fire? Because she's about to, to die to the fire. And I, I mean... I guess I'll put out the fire. Gosh! And then I will begin to walk away. Uh, I, mean, yeah. I guess I will put out the fire. I need a shower after this. I feel fucking horrible. <laughs> like, it's in character. I don't regret what I did, but like... Exotic, like, out of character, you told you told Nox to bully them. <laughs> no, 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 that was hilarious evil. <laughs> evil hilarious. What are you trying to do, Nox? I'm sorry. Uh, is she like withholding information? It doesn't look like it. She really is just a bumbling, bumbling adventurer. Uh, the last of her team. Would, like evil deeds are are justified if they're funny. No. Should yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're justified. Look at America. Did you loot her in front? Of her? <laughs> 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 well, I need it. 
<laughs> I need a broth. He goes, mmm, healing potion. What Name is on healing the potion? I'm gonna see that the, the Colossus has fallen, and I'm just gonna get very angry and be like, You distract me from a worthy foe, and you run away, you coward! And I will go after him. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh the no. monk moment. Oh, the monk moment. <laughs> the fucking- I'm just imagining- I'm just- Oh god, hold on, I gotta find the gif. <laughs> there it is! <laughs> that will critically hit. Oh, damn. How do you want to do this? <clears throat> is he kind of against the wall? Yeah. Yeah, no, I'm gonna run up and I'm gonna, like, fucking roundhouse kick his head straight into the wall. It's... <laughs> It literally crushes his uh his sport toy head and that will adjourn yeah. combat. Cheering that shit loot, behind you and loot, then fucking die. Ah. And uh for the time being, that is where we'll end the session.